WGRAMIREZLAS Vegas, app, no team has been to the Stanley Cup final more than the Montreal Canadiens. Now they stand one victory away from a 35th appearance and their first in 28 years. Carey Price made 26 saves to lead Montreal to a 4-1 victory over the Vegas Golden Knights on Tuesday night, putting the Canadians one step closer to the Stanley Cup final. You know, it's the oldest cliché in hockey, but the fourth one's going to be the hardest and we're fortunate to have the opportunity at home and we'll be ready to go in Game 6, said Eric Stahl, whose second period goal held up as the game winner. The Canadians, who last won the Stanley Cup in 1993, lead Vegas 3-2 in their best of seven series, with Game 6 scheduled for Bell Centre in Montreal on Thursday. Jesperi Kotkaniemi, Cole Caulfield and former Golden Knight Nick Suzuki also scored for the Canadians, whose 11th playoff victory is the franchise's most in one postseason since the 1993 championship run, also the last time a Canadian-based team won the title. The Canadians, who rallied from a 3-1 series deficit in the first round against Toronto and swept Winnipeg in the second round, shook off Sunday's home loss in Game 4 to win for the second time in Las Vegas. I think that's what our mindset has been this whole playoff, is getting to do what we do, regardless of what happens," Stahl said. I don't think we change much. We do what we do every single shift, every moment we have, every opportunity we have to try and be difference makers for our team. Meanwhile, as Max Pacioretty was the only one to score for Vegas, the storyline remained the same with Vegas struggling to find its offense against Montreal's suffocating tactics in limiting space and dominating the neutral zone. The Golden Knights had 56 shot attempts, with 12 missing the target and 17 others being blocked. Mark andre Fleury, the league's active leader in playoff wins, 90, and games played, 162, made 22 stops in front of an announced crowd of 17,969 that were left stunned with the Golden Knights now on the brink of elimination. The Golden Knights, who have scored 11 goals in the series, have gotten just four from their forwards. You can point to a lot of things, we just weren't sharp in our execution, in our decisions and it cost us, Golden Knights coach Peter Deboa said. We've got to find a way. You've got to find a way this time of year against the good teams, and against pressure, and against tension, against a good goalie. Those are the teams that end up standing at the end of the day. Montreal's forwards continued to stand tall, scoring all four goals in the win. Kotkaniemi was the beneficiary of strong defensive play in Vegas' offensive zone, as Montreal defensemen Jeff Petrie and John Merrill created a turnover to push the puck in transition. Josh Anderson streaked past Vegas defenseman Zach Whitecloud and pulled Fleury to his far right with a backhand that was stuffed.